So uh, we went up to Thousand Oaks today, and I go fly side over there to the Oaks Mall. As we're over there, uh, I've been noticing this increase in people wearing masks. And then I see a couple of buses go by, say, and on the side of them, it says, masks are encouraged. <laughs> well, to me, that figures correctly because people that have money, they want to, those people are protected, so they're not trying to encourage masks on them uh, unless they're stupid enough to wear one. But the people that are don't have money, they do. They want to. Despite overwhelming evidence and studies about the perilous effects of masks causing hypercapnia, masks on children, uh, and the fact that, just like I've always said, everything coming out of a human body is disgusting, including your fucking nasty-ass salami breath. Uh, why would you want to keep your drawers with a big old dump in them? Or why would you want to have your pee pants all fucking soaked wet? Why the fuck would you want to breathe your same shit in all the time? But I've noticed this increase in people masking off. Uh, it's just fucking retarded, you know. And of course, I guess if you got the if you wore the mask the first time, then you probably killed a shit ton of brain cells. So any fucking deductive reasoning you might have had left has probably been burnt and gone to the wind. But there's another point. It's more subtle. These things are dangerous. I used to wear a mask. I'm a carpenter. I did hardwood floors for seven years exclusively. They create a very fine dust. You have to wear certain masks just to be able to... You don't want particulate matter going in your lungs. But on the other hand, you change them out very regularly because when they get ill, you, know, you just kind of know when. Um, but the powers that be that want people to wear masks, they know that it, the resistance that they encountered in the scamdemic uh, the first time, it's it wanes. So now any kind of logical reasoning that someone might have had about not wearing one the first time, well, they keep pushing it and pushing it. And eventually the relentless nature of social manipulation is such that it wears the individual fucking thought processes down and people start wearing. Or you just get, uh, as is evidenced by kids age zero to 22, they're fucking retarded, most of them. The ones that aren't, stand out in the crowd. But if you don't have an intelligent audience to begin with, then who's going to offer resistance again? So the more they can poison us with masks, chemtrails, all this other bullshit, our food, our water, our uh, everything, every fucking thing. Oh, and not to mention medicine. And uh, now I've become completely distrusting of medical advice. The last time I went to the hospital for my feet being swollen and infected, the advice that I got, I got some antibiotics, which helped. I don't like them, but they did help. Uh, they probably killed every other uh, good biotic in me, but it doesn't matter. Got the bad shit dying off. But their advice, not even per a doctor, because I went to the emergency room and I wasn't able to see a doctor. I saw a nurse practitioner. Her advice was stop smoking. 
Now, I smoke with a cigarette up here by my head. My feet are at the other end of my body. I fail to really understand how the rest of it could go relatively unscathed, but that's going to be the place where the smoking's going to show up. And that was it. I got a script for antibiotics, and I got advice to stop smoking. Oh, that's so convenient. Because that way, they don't have to do any fucking work. So yeah, we're getting killed there, too. Um, and then not just poisoning your body, poisoning your mind. But they want people to willingly poison themselves with their own stinking salami fish breath. And uh, everybody's more than willing to do it. Well, not everybody, but a lot of people. It's an increasing number of people masking off in their cars by themselves, windows up. <laughs> this goes right along with the whole, why ask about your rights? Why it is the dumb, the dumbing down of America. Everybody, uh, there's some smart people and there's some, but the majority, I don't care whether the majority is laboring under economic burdens, whether their fucking job prospects are getting cut because of the flood of able-bodied Latinos and people coming across, military age coming across in um, droves across the border, of which we've seen tons. There is just, it seems, no common sense or spine because the people that possess common sense aren't willing to grab some fucking dumbass by the scruff of his neck, give him a bitch slap across his face and say, hey, stupid, stop being stupid. <laughs> 